Little Squad, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, I'm Jasmine and welcome to my channel. In today's video, I am super excited because I finally got my pick skates. I don't know if you guys can see, but I got my pick skates and if you guys don't know what pick skates are, they are pretty much just rollerblade frames that you can attach to your figure skates and they are the best thing in the entire world. I, if you guys wanted to know, I have the 994 Pick Professional Frame Set, and I also have the four wheel one, not the three wheel one. But I got them last night. It was a little bit too late to do a video for you guys, but I had to test them out because I was so excited for them to come, and I was so happy when they arrived. So when I tested them out, I feel like I did pretty good on my first day, which was yesterday. So today is my second day for you guys. And I was able to do my single axle, double toe, double flip, and all of my single jumps. So I feel like my jumps were working pretty well. The only thing that was a little bit harder for me was spinning because it feels really different. But anyways, I'm going to insert those clips that I got from yesterday for you guys. I hope that you guys enjoyed those clips from yesterday, but without further ado, I'm going to start off today's video with my new pick skates, but before we do anything, you have to warm up.
Okay, so it's a little bit harder to go backwards on these because if you go too far forward on your toes, then the toe pick will stop you. It's not like on the ice where you just scrape your toe on the ice because this toe pick will completely stop you from moving. But I'm gonna try doing some backwards things now. Now I'm going to start doing jumps. So I'm going to start with singles, like from waltz jump, all the way to single lets, and then I'm going to start doing single axles and then slowly doing some doubles. When you feel it's hopeless, when you think that you lost, oh, I will take your hand and we'll rise up from the dust. Oh, here we go. because they feel a lot like you're on the ice. The only thing that I don't really like is that you're outside and it is super hot. It's literally almost like 100 degrees outside and I am melting. So that's the good thing about ice skating and ice rinks is that it is a lot colder in the ice rink and you're not melting while you're skating around.
try to do some combos. I think I'm going to try doing an axle toe loop combo. I've never tried doing combos on these skates, so we're just going to try them out and see what happens. part now I have to try to figure out how to spin in these because it is really hard and it's a little bit different than figure skating different like not doing jumps or spins more like connecting elements like spirals and stuff like that Okay, so now I'm going to try to put together a program. It's not going to be like three minutes long like my program that I have right now, but it's going to be about like 30 seconds long, but don't judge me guys because this is my first time doing a program and only my second time on my fixed skates. So I have no idea how this is going to turn out. <laughs>
that was it for the video that I had for you guys today. I really hope you guys enjoyed. I had a lot of fun skating in them, especially that it makes it feel like I'm actually skating, except that it's really hot outside. But it feels like I'm skating, and I'm just happy that I can have the feeling of skating after like six weeks of being off because I really miss the ice. And this is the closest that I can get. I really hope that you guys enjoyed though. I want you guys to comment down below how do you guys think I did. And also comment down below if you guys want me to do a update after a week on my improvement with the pick skates. So I'll do that video for you guys if you want me to do it. Anyways, also don't forget.